Aloha friends! Welcome back to A Simply Simple Life. Today I do have a what's in my bag video to share with you guys today. I have been using this bag for a little over a month and she needs to, she needs to go on vacation. She needs to retire back into the closet or the, the cabinet that I have her in. And so before I do that, I wanted to go ahead and film this and let you guys see what's usually in the bag. So I have not taken out anything out of the bag since I last used it, Pinky Promise, except my lipstick that's over there because I, I have that on a separate video. I'm going to show you guys um, a haul right after this one of like what I have been using or what I recently bought as far as like body clothes, face <laughs> kind of thing. So there was a lipstick in here and then I had this thing in here that was there so I put it back in here. Other than that, that's that's it. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I just have it on this wobbly table so I do apologize. It might be a bit wobbly when I place stuff on it. But um, for this one, I do have my <laughs> luggage. <laughs> no. My humongous, um, I gotta back up. <laughs> my humongous GM Neverfull um, in a monogram print. <laughs> and it's huge. It's, it's a travel bag, it's a school bag, it's a mommy bag. And I'm a mommy of four even though I have two now. That's um, not considered babies, but they're still my babies. And I feel that the bigger your bag is, the more stuff you have in it. it. And not necessarily because you need it for that particular day. It's just the bigger the bag, it's like the more stuff you feel it. And this is why I feel like it's about time that she needs to uh, to get some rest. Because it's just each, each week, it just seems to be getting heavier and heavier. Um, so... Like I said, this is um, <laughs> this is the Neverfull. I'm gonna I'm gonna back you guys up. Oh, hello, Aloha, friends. How are you? Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm by my window, so let me move you guys a bit. Right by my window. Okay, so that you guys can see. I have had this bag uh, for about, gosh, about almost a year. Okay. Alright, so ever since I've been using this uh, monogram, Never Full, I did treat it with Apple brand uh, stain and rain repellent spray. And I'm so glad that I did. I'm like sinking into my chair. I'm so glad that I did because I live over here in the Pacific Northwest, North Seattle, and we have drizzle rain throughout the year. I would say drizzle rain about 10 months out of the year okay not the heavy year season but the only really full summer that we have is july and august where we rarely rarely get rain and if we do it be you know a few days other than that it can rain almost every day not constant but there would be numerous times that i would be inside the grocery store uh leaving my house sunny and then go into a grocery store, supermarket, what have you, uh, or Target, and then I come out and it's like pouring rain or drizzle. Okay, so to me, investing into the Apple brand uh, to spray all the Vachetta, which I did, was a really big investment. This is going to be a long video. It's already six minutes. Okay, but it's still patinaed over time, um, except for this one. This one I also sprayed, but I just got this around Christmas time. Uh, for this luggage tag so if you guys can see the different color um, this one's very light and then this is becoming to be a bit more like the um, patina color okay I did get wet um, I did however got caught um, in the rain last week last week or a few days ago and it drizzled on certain parts okay but a few days later when I remembered about it there, there was no more spots. It, there was spotty when it was wet, but then it dried up. Okay, 
So I was really happy about that. And I can tell because it, it was like right here at the top and it's no longer there. Okay, so let's get into what's in my bag. All right, so first of all, I have, oh, let me show you guys what's in my bag. All right, so this is what's in my bag. If you guys can see, pretty, I say it's pretty full. Um, it's got, it's got a lot of stuff in there. Okay, I'm like trying to see if I have anything confidential. Um, like I said, I, I should just check that first before I just like show you guys all. But no, nothing confidential. I, I do have a, a purse organizer in there that I bought through Etsy. Very good investment because then it has the pocket so that everything is just not dumped in there. It's well organized. Okay, first off, um, I guess to the side of the pocket. <laughs> to the side of the pocket, I have this, which is just a, um, what is this? Oh, Danica's, oh, Danny's visit to the, to the doctor. She had apparently a today's visit. She is 70th percentile for her BMI. Uh, 54th percentile for her weight and then her height she's the 21st percentile my my girls have always been short okay so that's there and I need I keep those because I, I file the the yearly checkups for them okay I don't know why I, I have a little like accordion folder that I put uh, grades school like go through important school stuff and then uh, doctor's visit especially when they're young like the percentile okay so I have what do I have here oh I was covering my address but I have a bake magazine this is the latest one I think yeah November December and then I always have some sort of something to read in here in a bag I don't know why even though I don't most of the time I don't really read it because if I'm going on a car ride with hubby or um, like I said the doctor's visit then I can go through that's the time that I'll go through magazines because I don't really have time to go through my my magazine subscription, which I only have three. Martha Stewart, this one that I really chose. But then I have like, I think, Home Living or whatever from the kids fundraiser that I have to choose something. So usually it's just a magazine. Um, then we get that. But I like this because I think two years. Normally I paid a few of these over at Costco and they were like $12.99. And then the inserts... Or they had a special for two years for $24.99. So you can't beat that, right? But it's baking also. And I love to bake. I love to look at pictures. <laughs> I love to look at cookbooks. Uh, I'm a window shopper baking bake book person. I don't know. I'll, I, I find enjoyment in flipping through the pages. But I don't really per se do the recipe unless I really really want to I just enjoy looking at the pictures and who wouldn't come here look at those okay my goodness look at that who would not want to look at that picture okay I got that and like I said I'm doing this now because I want to switch out my bag to a smaller one okay and then I got this one on the side pocket and then this one is from simply gilded and I use this one and it's so pretty look at that Alright guys, kid, look at look how pretty it is. Perfect for spring. Okay, so on this one I have, what do I have here? Address book, Erin Condren. So this is where I'm putting address book and I I don't think I'm doing a good job because most most pages are still empty. All my addresses, all my contacts are on my phone. Oh, I was gonna say my phone's not here, but because I'm charging it. Okay very nice um i used to do a subscription box for simply gilded and then planner society for my planners and so um it would come with like nice bags or pouches and this was a really nice one and then the nice thing about this one it also has a little clip if you want to use it as a clutch i guess yeah if i had wanted to use it as a clutch i could okay sorry i almost dropped it okay so what's in here Okay, I have a coupon, Fred Myers. Oh, I just bought some, I just bought the kids uh, Squishmallows, the girls. So, have that in there. And then, what is this? Oh, this is, this is a, this is an Alex and Ani. I put it in here so I will not forget it. But apparently, I have a package that's being prepped up and I almost forgot it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm glad I'm doing this video. I have, what is this? I don't know. Sally Beauty. Oh, when I colored my hair. All right, this is a home, 
uh, home DIY coloring of the hair that you guys are seeing now. Um, it's the first bleaching process. I'm going to bleach it again, but I'm going to wait about three months or two months or so when, um, when my hair gets a bit more healthy. Okay, so I have that, so, which I can throw away because I'm not going to return any of the products. I have coupons from Bath & Body Works and I thought I had another coupon. Oh. Oh, a Starbucks. I don't know if there's money in there. I could have sworn I had another one. Oh, here. <laughs> I, I think I put it up here because I did not want to forget about this. Free panty with a purchase. $10 off February now through February 23rd. Because, friends, I have lost two coupons from Victoria's Secret of like, you know, spend for your birthday. Yeah, for the birthday one. My birthday was in August. And they sent me a coupon and I never used it because I totally forgot. So, that's why I just have it in there. And then, um, Bath and Body Works, is it still good? Now through the 28th. So, I want to put that in the... Wait, I'm not going to use the bag anymore. I'm going to put it on my desk. Wait. I don't know. What kind of bag am I going to use? You know what? I'm going to put it on my desk. Just so I know. And then I'm going to put the card on my desk because I got to figure out if I got money in there. But other than that, I really like this pouch. All right, because I am changing out my purse, so I don't know if I'm going to use a big one or not. Okay, now, <laughs> this one is also part of the other haul, so I took it out of here, put it there, and then put it back in here. But this is a, this is a square, I believe, shawl, and I just got this for like $20, I think, from Target, and it's square, and it's nice, and it's very light, and it's supposed to be a dupe, I think, of Burberry. I think that's what the site was um, but it's just brown and you know like a Burberry design and I have this here one because I don't use jackets like I'll even though it's freezing cold I'll wear this type of a sweater legging so when it's very cold then it acts as a like a shawl like covering me up when, when I'm walking outside outdoors but also <laughs> I wear I have this for my baby so when it's raining and then I have her, I'll cover her up with the shawl so that she doesn't, she doesn't get wet. Oh, for real, friends, I'm not even joking. So it's perfect because it's so big that, one, it warms me up and it covers me up. And then I can rush to the car without having her get wet. I also use this, like, when we fly, uh, which, of course, because of COVID, um, hubby and I have not flown since I think it was March. We went to downtown Disney um, Just for like a family up not a family just me and hubby like a quick date Because we love Disney, but I use this for hubby and I to To sleep. I don't like to sleep in the plane unless I have like like a light blanket covering me and remember back in the days when when airplanes used to provide the pillows and the blankets well, I used those pillows and blankets and now being grown, I used them as a kid when we used to travel with my parents, but now thinking about it, I'm like, oh my gosh, all the germs on that thing because they do not wash the pillows and the blankets every single person that uses it. They just store it up onto the store thing. Anywho, so I got my own blanket. All right, so then over here, I have this one. I really, really love this one. You guys have seen this onto my Instagram and also my vlogs. This is the Michael Kors. This is going to be a super long video. Michael Kors Whitney wallet, chain wallet, I think. I love it because if it happens to be raining, happens all the time, I will put my bag in the trunk of the car if it's raining and then just grab this. Or... If I decide to go somewhere and I'm still in the house uh, and then I have this big bag and I'm like oh my gosh it's raining outside as soon as I step outside then I don't worry because then I just grab this and this one has my like two debit cards in here and it has cash all right quick tip of saving money because you guys know like I I purchase like Louis Vuitton bags and I always say I save money when I purchase something at the grocery store, not every every single time, but especially payday, like hubby's payday or my payday or a bonus here or a bonus there from our work, then what I do is I take out $20 cash or $40 cash and I keep it in my wallet and then 
I've done, and then I have this pochette. It's pretty heavy. I'm, I'm sure it's just coins. But I'll take out cash of 20 and just put it in here. And I won't, I won't count it. And then I have another spot that I hide it somewhere um, in the house just in case I'm going to be robbed. I don't want to say where I'm hiding my money. I'm just joking. It's not even enough. It's not worth it. <laughs> but um, there has been times that I forget that I'm hiding money because of these things like whatever cash I have I rarely have any cash so don't even don't rob me <laughs> I have I rarely have cash but if I do then I usually take it out and then put it into like um like wherever I'm storing it and it changes because if my kids find it or my hubby finds it then I'm like oh. Because then I tend to go to it like, oh, mom, I need $20 for school or I need this or I need that. And then, one, I have cash to give them. Or two, I'm like, darn it, I don't want to give them that cash. I just want to write them a check kind of thing. But anywho, okay, so in here, I have cash. And I don't know. And then coins. Okay? And I don't know how much and I don't want to count. But that's what I do. Um, especially because hubby and I, our paydays are different. Um we get paid basically every every money i mean every week money comes in and because his payday is one week and then my payday is the next week kind of thing so whenever i go and get cash for like um eyebrows or mani petty then i take cash out for tips and then also for my stash okay anywho <laughs> i just wanted to share that with you guys but i love this because look it comes out and then it comes out here too so if I did not want to use this then I can always attach this onto part of the Neverfull like hi friends look because the Neverfull has that that thing and then look it's just dangling and it's so tight like I only keep I used to keep my like um what do you call that my debit card right here because it's pretty tight but now I just keep what do I have in here Oh, my Costco card, which I don't mind losing, and then my my nails, my nails punch card, because I want my ten dollars off. <laughs> but yeah, so this is where I just have my Costco card, and then this is where I have my don't look at my picture, my driver's license, and then in here I can have a little cash, okay, a little cash, or if I wanted, then that can be my debit card, okay. But isn't that cool? And then I won't need this or I just you know use it somewhere else and then I like it because one I have the key pouch that uh that I just bought and it's part of that haul, haul the monogram because even if you have an LV wallet which I kind of don't want to invest on because they're so expensive but I am thinking about the Karagami uh, pochette but anywho even if I have the wallet the the pouch I, it still get wet so that's why i love this this is michael kors if it gets wet if it gets ruined i don't like i'm not so heartbroken i paid 60 dollars for this friends and it's one of my favorite like purse small purse and and then i have like kids um insurance cards in there and then i have a, um, a debit card in there okay so it's like that right and then you can either have it to where it's like this to where it's like hold on to your arm or how I had it, how I had it of a miniature mini, mini purse. Okay, I always get attention for this. So I don't even know if they carry it anymore. I bought it at the mall, at my Michael Kors mall last year. All right, friends, we're, we're, all, we're not even barely making it. Oh dear. Okay, I have my Switch game. I have my switch game and I don't know if it's still powered on but I like I said when Dan Danny had her appointment and I have a doctor's appointment today so I gotta make sure it's charged I only play Animal Crossing and I'm not even good at it but I I have it okay because it's peach <laughs> I like I have it I have to have it in my purse once in a while I'll play it like in car rides I'll play it okay and then I have oh wait the other side I have I have a library book 
okay best garden plants for washington and oregon i just picked this up and then again i like to glance through it like oh you know what kind of plants do i want to plant for my region library and library is so nice because one it's a free book and two you just call you you order it online and then you have do a curbside pickup so okay but before i started going through it i did wipe it down with a disinfectant one okay I have a couple of pouches. I'm a pouch girl. I like pouches within pouches of pouches within a bag organizer. I don't like to just dump everything in there. So here is, I think this is Simply Gilded, no, nope, Planner Society. And over here I have for my planner that I always try to have. So I just have a few. I have uh, washi tape and then I have like the basic necessities. Okay, I have a pencil, but I was using it. I have a marker, pretty, pretty pen, another pretty pen. These are from their sub boxes. Okay, Simply Gilded is the blue. She's uh, famous for her little uh, bow ties, and then I have red. Okay, and then blue My, uh, pen. Got that. And then I have this one. This is from Ipsy. When I used to um, get a subscription for Ipsy bag, I don't anymore, but I'm thinking of doing it for Danny. I did it for Danielle when she was about 12, 13, somewhere in there. I have a Scentsy Dazzling Pomegranate, because you never know when you need to do that room spray. <laughs> oh, okay, and then I have a Bath and Body Works uh, Stress Relief Lotion, and then I'm a Scentsy Consultant, so I have this and then make sure I smell good I have my essay always gives me samples I have California dream in here which I actually tried on yesterday California dream and it's a bit I don't know how we said it's light I thought it was like I like to put it in my hair uh, I thought it was a bit strong but liking it okay so not bad he gives me a whole bunch of these little samples because when hubby and i would travel he said it's it's good so. all right friends i gotta hurry it up okay so one pouch two pouch and then i have this one and this one is my mass this one is a mass uh, one for me one for danica extra and then a like a carbon filter in there and then uh, my glasses <laughs> These are like just in case I'm driving and then I can't see. Um, I'm is it nearsighted when I can't see far away? So I got my. Whoa! See when I'm looking, it's kind of blurry, but I need it for far away, which I never wear it. But every month, oh my, not every every year I get it because I only pay twenty five because our insurance. So I have so many glasses, but I don't wear them. Oh, I like it. How is it friends? I can't I can't see because it's blurry. How is it? How is it? Okay, let's see. Let's see. And then my hair is so gray. Okay. Took that picture. Who I don't wear it because it's so like it's so blurry. Um so then the optometrist is is that what they're called? The eye doctor said, Well, do you want bifocals? I said no, but it's a Burberry, and I paid twenty five bucks for that because of insurance. We have uh, we have good insurance for vision. So every one of the family except for Danny wears glasses. So we always get one every year because even though I forgot how much this was, like two hundred, uh, we only pay twenty five dollars. Okay, and then it's a yearly visit to get our eye check, and we don't pay anything for that. So why not? So I have like five seven glasses and i've never used them but i have it here just in case i'm driving or just in case i'm driving and i get into an accident god forbid knock on wood and then it says i need glasses and then the police officer officer's like well where's your glasses <laughs> okay anywho hurry up then hurry up all right and then i took out my um my Louis Vuitton A5 planner and the reason that I well I have that in there oh wait I was gonna say that the reason I'm showing you guys I'm getting it mixed up is um my other haul I wanted to show the like the dashboard that I got which is really cute but that's gonna be in my other haul so yeah so this is for appointments and such I, I don't mix anything here these are just appointments and 
and such and I don't like I try not to overcrowd this I like to decorate it like make it a little pretty I can't really make it too pretty because I, I'm not that talented not cute but I have it in here okay so I don't want to go over that too much but what else oh we're almost done I have glasses Oh, that's go supposed to go there too. Okay, what is this? Oh, yes. I got this recently for Christmas. These are the kids. I asked the kids. Sorry, that's my curtain. I know my curtain is clean because I just washed it in December. <laughs> Anywho. Okay, back up. Um, this is $12.99 on, on Amazon. But I love it. Isn't that cool? I, I love the gray. And then I also got it in pink or peach. Because I love I love the how it frames my face. What do you guys think? Not bad for a 60 year old. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yesterday Danica says, I'm rocking this. Anyways, with her unicorn outfit. Okay, I like that. That's actually going to go into the other one. Okay. Because I'm filming this before the other one. I don't know if I said I was doing that first or this one. But anywho. Alright. We're almost done. I have, I always... I always have one of these icebreakers and it's always these. I like the the icebreakers. Either this or like the watermelon with the strawberry. But this is watermelon, green apple, and tangerine. And you never know when you need a a mint, right? But the girls and Danica always go in here and try to, to take it. But I just have it into one of the pockets. Oh my gosh, friends. That's it. Look. I, I really did not have a lot. I have a Sensi lotion of Pina Colada Cha Cha because I don't like when I can feel the roughness of like callus my finger and then plus I'm constantly using the hand sanitizing wipes that my hands tend to like be very very dry or I did not realize this but six months of the pandemic I was holding on to disinfecting wipes while shopping the store and that's how I got my numbness feeling. Because now I don't do that. I don't feel that numbness. Anywho. Ponytail. Keys. And I got that. I got a receipt. Oh, Chanel. Receipt at Trader Joe's. I spent $75.28. Wow. From one little receipt. I wonder what I bought. Why? Sorry, I'm like just surprised. It's $75 for one receipt. Sometimes like you forget to look at the amount. Okay, I'm in the... I'm shopping for a new perfume. These are... Sorry. These are my go-to perfume. This is the... Chance um, Chanel. Apparently, they have a couple of them. And then, is it the Rose the Vents from Louis Vuitton? I don't even know. I just call it Rose. And then it's nice with Louis Vuitton because if you run out and you really like the perfume, they just refill it for, I think, one fifty compared to two fifty or two sixty five of purchasing. It. And then you can put your initials. But I'm in. I'm shopping for a new new scent and i only like light light scent not too light but um not musky okay last pocket friends more scrunchies i'm sorry now i have now i have candy Ooh. oh there we go now i have candy but i have a scrunchie white because i like i like big buns <laughs> and then lip balm always have to have a lip balm and then i have a lip balm in there and a lipstick but because i'm gonna do that video i do not want to forget anywho that's it i should have taken a picture of what was in my bag first <sighs> all right friends that is it that's all i have for the what's in my bag uh video to share with you guys i'm so sorry this is super long i did not realize i had so much stuff in there but i don't that's it and then i have um Oh wait, let me see the pocket. I don't think I have anything in here. Yeah, nope. 
nope nothing that's it and then like i said i have the bag organizer which works really well and then when i store it um i don't store it flat like it takes such a long time for you to get um the shape of the bag that if you store it then it's actually bad for the bag of flattening it back up as if when you first purchased it from the store so because now i have a bag organizer i don't put a pillow because when i store it into my uh billy bookcase that has a glass so it's not getting dirty then i it fits right in right into the shelf just like that okay and then she's just going to be stored just like that.